Thursday morning, Dominic Steele and Daily Bible Time, and I'm thinking of someone whose life is hanging in the balance. But, you know, whether or not she has a future on earth, she certainly has a future in heaven because she's in Christ. She was caught up with the Lord Jesus in his death. She's caught up with him in his resurrection. There's a future beyond this earthly life, a future guaranteed by the resurrection of Christ Jesus. So look with me. We're in Colossians chapter 2, verse 13. When you were dead in your sins and in the uncircumcision of your sinful nature, God made you alive with Christ. He forgave us all our sins. I mean, there was a list, a list of wrong, a list of offenses, a list of debt that I had to God. And what did God do with this list? Verse 14, he cancelled the charge of our legal indebtedness that was against us. He's taken it away, nailing it to the cross. Christ looked at that list, that document of offences of Dominic, and took that document and blotted it out. Not just taken the document out and wiped it out. He took the document out and obliterated it. He slammed that document, slammed that document into the cross. He smashed it to smithereens, never to be found again. That's what Christ does with my wrong before God. According to Colossians 2. Verse 13, 14, 15. And you know what? All the other spiritual forces in the world, do you know how they compare to relationship with Christ? They're disarmed. They're useless. They're impotent. They're ineffective. They're humiliated. Look at 15. Having disarmed the powers and authorities, he made a public spectacle of them, triumphing over them by the cross. Every other religious system in the world is all ultimately about stuff that you need to do, to try and do, to try and achieve in order to be acceptable by the divine. But Christ in his fullness, Christ gives us such a much bigger view of God, a, a much, much bigger. The others are useless, impotent, ineffective and humiliated because none of them have love, not like Christ has love. None of them give fullness, not like Christ give full, gives fullness. And if you have Christ for you,